Church members were devastated when the statue of Mother Mary vanished almost a week ago. Many prayed for its return and wondered who could have taken the statue. Well, News Channel 8's Peter Bernard is live at the Saints Peter and Paul of Apostles Church in Bradenton with some good news, I believe, tonight, right, Peter? Good evening, Josh. Indeed, some good news. This is where the statue used to stand and greet people as they'd come into the church. Now you see it's just an empty pedestal. The good news is this morning somebody found that statue on the side of the road and returned it. In the garden-like setting of the Saints Peter and Paul the Apostles Catholic Church in Bradenton, 14 statues greet visitors. But near the Palmasola Boulevard entrance, one pedestal sits empty. Somebody made off with the five-foot-high fiberglass Mother Mary statue. Parishioners were upset. When you learned she was missing, was that a heartbreak to you? Oh, my God. It's like, you know, what on earth? Almost a week after the statue disappeared, a road crew saw it hidden here, less than a half mile away. One of them spotted it, and um, he said, there's a, there's a saint in the bushes here. Undamaged and in the same weather-worn condition it was when it was taken, the statue sat. And they said, Mary can't be in a bush, so they, they retrieved her, and when the authorities came and explained where it was from, then they brought her to us this morning. Church members are relieved the statue is back. Thank God we found her, oh my gosh. Happy about that? Yeah, thrilled to death. I love the Blessed Mother. Oh God, she means a lot to me. I don't know why anybody would do something like that. You know, it's a crazy world nowadays. It is. Your reaction gone. now that it's back, though? I'm really glad. Father Huberger figures the thieves rocked the statue a bit and discovered the bolts holding it in place rusted. It wouldn't have any value if they wanted to put it on eBay or Craigslist. You know, who's going to buy it? Mother Mary will undergo some refurbishment, and it'll soon be back welcoming visitors to this peaceful place. And just to be clear there, that was an effect that we did right there. Father Huberger tells me he thinks this whole theft is a prank, and he does not plan to press charges if they catch these st statue thieves. Josh? I thought you had some uh, serious religious power there for a minute there, Peter. But did the parishioners, did they know this statue was gone in the first place? Some did in the story, but how about as a whole? Yeah, the, the father in the story uh, made an announcement during Mass over the weekend, and he said that if you happen to see anyone with it, did not confront him. He didn't want any kind of a, a bad situation to happen. The good news is it was found, and it'll soon be back behind me there. All right, happy ending there. Peter, thanks for the story. Thanks for the update.